In this video we're going to show you how to add journal articles and book chapters which aren't in the library's collections to Talis Elevate. Your first step, if you haven't already, is to bookmark the resource on your module's reading list. You simply follow the normal steps for bookmarking a resource as described on our reading list subject guide. You can bookmark the article or chapter from places like the publisher's website or an online bookseller. Make sure you select the correct resource type and you've got all of the correct details. When you then add it to the list, set its importance as essential and when you're ready, select publish. You now need to request a digital copy of the resource. To do this, go to our reading list subject guide, click into the guidance on using Talis Elevate and go into the request for Talis Elevate digitization form. You'll need to provide your name, email address, department, module code, estimated student numbers on the module and the hyperlink to the specific resource. You can get the hyperlink by clicking on the three dots next to the resource and then clicking on share item. Once you've submitted the form, the library will try and acquire a digital copy for this resource for you. Please be aware this may take up to three weeks. Once it's available, the bookmark on the reading list will automatically update. You can then download a PDF copy of the resource. Please note, to comply with our licenses, you'll have to download a new digital copy at the start of each academic year to use in Talis Elevate. Once you have a copy of the resource, go to the Talis Elevate webpage. You can now upload the resource into Talis Elevate. When you're ready, you can share a link to the resource directly with your students or link to it on your module's Moodle page with the Talis Elevate Moodle plugin.